Dear students, I welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Maurice Mann and Michael Siletti. So in this video, I am solving the problem number 4.30 from the chapter number 4. The problem is using decoder and external gates design the combinational circuit defined by the following boolean functions so we are given with two parts of this question in the first part we have to find out or we have to realize these three functions using decoder and gates okay and in the second case also the same process we have to follow so in the first part the first uh, function is this one so here we can see that we have three variables x y and z so we can rewrite this equation as x bar y bar z bar okay plus this one we can write it as x y plus y dash this is y plus y dash will be 1 okay multiplied with 1 is the same okay z plus and x plus x bar because here x is missing okay in this term okay so we have written here x plus x bar it is the one value okay y z so from here we will get x bar y bar z bar plus x y z plus x y bar z plus from here we will get x y z plus x bar y z so let us rearrange these terms so x y z x y z two times we have so we can write only one time okay so x bar y bar z bar plus x y bar z plus this term i have written here then we will write this one x bar y z plus this term x y z okay so how we can write it as in sum of min terms expression so sum of this one is 0 0 0 means 0 comma this term is 0 1 1 means 3 this one is 1 0 1 means it is 5 and this is 7 so the min term expression is this one the second function is y bar z bar plus x y bar plus y z bar so x y bar z bar plus x bar y bar z bar okay here we have to write uh, multiply with z plus z bar so we'll get x y bar x y bar z plus x y bar z bar then in the third term we'll have x y z bar plus x bar y z bar so let us rewrite this terms so x bar y bar z bar plus x bar y z bar plus x y bar z bar plus so this term and this term are the same x y bar z bar so we can omit this one x y bar z and plus x y z bar so we can write it as 0 this one is 0 this is 2 this one is 4 this one is 5 and this one is 4 plus 2 it is 6 so second time we have got the sum of min terms expression we are finding the sum of min terms expression in this form because it will be easier for us to connect these uh, ports output ports of the decoder with a adder because we have summation here okay the third term is f3 is equal to x bar y bar z plus x y so we can write it as x bar y bar z plus x y z bar plus x y z okay so this is the expression so we can write it as sum of this one is one comma so here we have six and seven this term is seven okay so we have got the expression for f1 this is f1 so we have got for f2 and this is for f3 okay so we will use these equations from the decoder output and we will find out the circuit diagram so using this sum of min terms expressions we will design the circuit so here we will have a 3 is to 8 line decoder 3 is to 8 decoder okay it will have three inputs and the inputs are x y and z okay because we have seen here x 
y and z so this is 2 square 2 to the power 1 and 2 to the power 0 so here we'll have 8 outputs 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so these are the output ports so in the first case for f1 we have 0 3 5 7 and we have to add them so draw a adder and the inputs will be 0 3 5 7 0 3 5 and 7 okay so here we will get f1 similarly for f2 we have 0 2 4 5 6 okay so here we will get f2 and the input will be 0 2 okay 0 this line 0 we have 4 5 6 this one is 4 okay so give a direct input here 4 and this line is 5 and 6 so connect here so this is the function f2 and similarly for f3 we have 1 6 7 so here we will use another or get to add these three terms 1 6 and 7 so one line is this one coming here so take a line from here 1 then 6 and 7 so this is the circuit diagram for the given functions for the realization of the given functions f1 f2 and f3 using decoder and or gates okay now let us go to our second part of the problem in the second part we are given with another three functions f1 f2 and f3 so part b f1 is equal to y bar plus x into z so let us multiply this y bar z plus xz we have to multiply with x plus x bar y bar z plus x y plus y bar z okay so here we'll get x y bar z plus x bar y bar z plus x y z plus x y bar z so x y bar z is already there so we can omit one of them so we can write it as x bar y bar z plus x y bar z plus x y z so here we'll get f1 equal to sum of this one is 1 this is 5 and this one is 7 f2 is equal to we have y bar z bar plus x y bar plus y z bar x plus x bar whole into y bar z bar plus x y bar all into z plus z bar and x plus x bar whole into z bar so x y bar z bar plus x bar y bar z bar plus x y bar z plus x y bar z bar plus x here we have y x y z bar plus x bar y z bar so here we can see that we have x y bar z bar x y bar z bar so we can omit this one then we have sum of so the lowest term is this one so 0 comma this one is 2 comma 4 comma 5 okay and this one is 6 then f3 is equal to x bar plus y all into z okay so you can rewrite it as x bar z plus y z equal to x bar y y plus y bar z plus x plus x bar y z x bar y z plus x bar y bar z plus so this time will be x y z x bar y z x bar y z so here we have x bar y z x bar y z so we can omit this one okay so what we'll get so sum of 
this one is one this is three and this is seven okay so we have got the sum of in terms of expressions for f1 f2 f3 okay now let us draw the circuit so draw a 3 is to 8 line decoder so here we'll have three inputs x y z 2 square 2 to the power 1 2 to the power 0 okay 3 is to 8 decoder 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 okay so we have the f1 is 157 okay sum of 157 so you say or get here okay and draw lines from 157 1 this one is 5 this one is 7 okay so here we'll get f1 so similarly use another or get okay so here we'll get f2 so the inputs are f2 is 0 2 4 5 6 0 2 4 5 6 0 2 4 5 and 6 okay so this is the function f2 so use another or get for f3 okay you will get f3 and the inputs are 137 okay so take a line from 1 1 then 3 and 7 so 7 line is this one okay take a connection from here so here we got the function 3 okay so this is the circuit diagram using the given functions f1 f2 and f3 thank you for watching if you have any question please put it in the comment section below also like share and subscribe to my channel thank you